Hi folks, Sonia Ash here from Ash to Dime. Today I want to show you how to use our Frosted Glass Ornaments digital backdrop. So you can see we've got three ornaments here and we've also got three photos that we've got open in another window up here. So let's go ahead and get started. Let's um, click on our cutout photo number one and let's go ahead and click our first photo and you can see I've already cut this photo out um, there are many ways to do this uh, I'll put a link or two in the um, comments below to some other tutorials that will show you how to do that and you can see that I haven't done a great job on the bottom here and that's okay because there's a snow overlay in the glass ornaments that will cover that up so I wasn't super careful with that so with the move tool selected Let's click on our little girl here. Let's drag it up to our Frosted Glass Ornaments template and let's drop it right onto that canvas. Now, the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna scale this or transform. So Control T on your keyboard uh, or Command T for you Mac folks. And you're gonna to wanna to make sure that you're, lock, um, you're locked here to maintain the aspect ratio so that we're not distorting our image. And then you can click on any one of these four corners. Um, what I like to do is hold down my Alt key or Option key for you Mac folks. And as you do that, this will scale from the midpoint rather than from a corner. That just makes it a little bit easier. So you're going to scale that down so that your subject fits in there. And then you can go ahead and just sort of position it. Um, that looks pretty good right there. Then hit Enter on your keyboard. And that's going to go ahead and that's going to set your transformation. So we've got one down. Let's go ahead and click on cutout photo number two. And let's go to our next photo. Here's our little baby. Uh, so again, we're going with our move tool selected, we're going to click on the baby, drag it up to our template tab. We're going to drop it in right onto the canvas. And again, we're going to transform. So control or command T on your keyboard. I'm going to zoom out a little because he's kind of big. Um, holding down your Alt or Option key, we're going to transform this, scale him down. Let's zoom in on this just a little bit so we can see. Now he needs to um, be rotated somewhat. And you can see as I hover over any of the corners here, my cursor changes to a rotation tool. So let's just sort of rotate him. I think that's kind of good. Let's bring him down right underneath that snow layer. And that actually looks pretty good right there. So again, hit enter on your keyboard and that will set your transformation. And then let's click on our last photo. And let's go click up here. We've got our cute little dog. We're going to again, use our move tool, go over to our template tab, drop it down onto the canvas, control or command T and then we're going to hold in our Alt or Option key and we're going to bring that in, just size it down to where we want it and go ahead and just move him into place. Hit Enter on the keyboard to go ahead and set the transformation. And it's literally as easy as that. Your um, composition is complete at this point. We'd love for you to post your compositions on our Facebook wall. Um, I'll go ahead and I'll post that link to our Facebook page in the comments below. And we look forward to seeing some of your creations.